We had gone to watch um, a motocross race out at TNT, and he was asking when could he do that. And I said, Brandon, you can't even ride your bicycle without training wheels. And so the next day, he got his bicycle out, wanted me to take the training wheels off, not going to give up until he started riding without training wheels. So that was, he was four, and so that first night, he's like, so when am I going to get a motorcycle? And we were like, um, I really didn't expect that to happen. So we put him off and put him off for two years until he was six. Gone out to, we moved to Buffalo Lakes, and they had a little race out there, and there was other kids that were four to six. And he just sat there on the front of the golf cart and just watched and was just so intrigued and was like, please, please, please. Well, I was so surprised. He's always been kind of a, kind of a daredevil. And, and of course, who, who wouldn't dream of being able to ride a motorcycle? And we didn't think we were going to do jumps and get into racing the way we have. But we've met so many awesome families. And we have such a good time. We spend so much time together as a family. I mean, way more than we ever did. And it's just been kind of a journey for all of us that's been pretty exciting. I was like so excited when I went over the finish line because I knew I'd qualified and it was just amazing to have the feeling that I'm, I'm one of the top 40 riders in the whole world. It's been a long road leading up to, to trying to get there. A lot of preparation, a lot of, you know, a lot of training, a lot of going to a lot of races. Um, we don't have the opportunity out here in West Texas to ride a lot of great tracks like maybe people in the Metroplex there or a bunch of, of really hard tracks, a lot of good riders. It takes an extreme amount of financial resources and time. Um, you know, we've sacrificed vacations and time with our friends and family and you know we could be doing so many other things but we choose to do this neither one of us are pushing him or are trying to live vicariously through him or anything like that I mean this is his dream and this is as long as he wants to do this and is having fun and is enjoying it then you know we're gonna make that happen